Urgent medical update. The NHS has just had a stroke. Seriously. It could have been avoided, but down in the ED, the guts of the hospital, there is every chance we'll slump quietly into a corner, knowing that help will not be arriving anytime soon. The idiots have cancelled all locums for the foreseeable future. There is not a sniff of time off for a single one of us. So when you're in dire need of treatment and you look over and say that your medic has fallen asleep, try not to panic too much. You appear to have your hands inside a man's chest. Step aside, please. I'm not sure he's going to make it to the theatre. I'll be the judge of that. Right, how much blood has he had? Well, four units of packed red cells and four units of FFP. By the way, I'm loving the latest post. Surprise it's still up and running, though. I'm doing my best. Your best? Only losers talk about doing their best. Your time's up, Dr Hardy. I'm not a computer hacker. All I know is Serena wants to blog down by the end of the day. If you can't manage that, then she'll come down here, drag you outside, and throw you into the nearest job centre. She can't sack me for that. You run the ED. The blogger clearly works here. Someone, namely you, will be held responsible. So you better get busy and end this, Ethan, before it ends you. Have you got a minute? I'm about to have a meeting, actually. Yes, uh, I am the meeting. How do you mean? You can't go after Rash. How did you know it was him? Noel's been playing detective. <laughs> yeah, of course. I finally worked it out from the cases he was writing about. Clever. Wrong person, though. Sorry? You asked me to do some digging. Which you refused, yeah. Because I didn't need to. I know who the blogger is, Ethan. So before you hang the wrong person, you need to know that uh, I was mentoring him on the cases that were blocked about. I usually spend my lunch break avoiding all human contact, so this had better be good. It's not good, if I'm honest. But I found the blogger. Will you hide that bruising bitterness well? So as the quiet ones who shout the loudest. Wait, it's... Dr. Munro, she... Um, she helped me work it out. Well, give me the name then. I left a cappuccino for this. All I can say is the blog won't be back. And you know this because? Because I gave them an ultimatum. Either a meeting with Serena, or the site comes down forever. The name, Ethan. Anonymity was part of the deal, I'm afraid. And I don't think it looks good to hang one of our own. Depends who it is. There are quite a few people I wouldn't well, mind. I'm, I'm sure, but it's done. It's over. How did you work it out? Well, if I told you, you'd just work it out for yourself, so... Hmm. Like you're thinking, I'm almost impressed. So I can tell Serena and the board that it's all gone away? It definitely has. I don't know what to say. Why would you do that? Get out! <laughs> <laughs>